Hey guys, it's me Ashley. Welcome back to another video. So, hello, hi. <laughs> I feel like I need to make the statement that I am wearing clothes. It's just a bralette and then like a a tube top. So you can't really see the rest of it because it's a tube top, you know. But I am wearing clothes. I promise. <laughs> I feel like I have to be quiet because it's one in the morning. You're probably wondering, Ashley, why are you filming at one in the morning? Okay, I will be spending the next days until the 25th, which is actually my birthday, focusing on my birthday video, which my birthday video is I'm trying to make it the best that it can be, so I've been putting my full focus on my birthday video. I don't want to give any guesses as to what it will be. I literally only told two people. Like, I want it to be such a cool surprise. Um, and I guess I decided, like, why not make this little fun chit-chat video? Because I feel like time has passed and I haven't made, like, a sit-down chit-chat. So here we are. <laughs> it is one in the morning. Um, I have had this makeup on for a while, but it has stuck really nicely, which is good. My hair is frizzy because I've had it like this all day, obviously. <laughs> As you read from the title, uh, this is mainly just a catch up on things. Today, I went to the mall with my friends and I got my second cartilage piercing i'm pretty sure it's called cartilage every time i call it cartilage or cart i'm pretty sure it's cart cart cartilage every time i say that i think of ink cartilage cartridge i'm gonna stop saying it i'm just gonna say ear pierced i got my ear pierced on where the bone pretty much not really bone but like where it's more meat on the ear um it it wasn't red like this earlier. It's just red because I washed it with the solution that they gave me. Um, but yeah, I pretty much wanted to talk about my ears. So these, these are my ears. I just have this one, this one, which I got when I was like two years old. And then I got this one when I was 16, which is the bottom one. It's the one I'm playing with right now. That one. Uh, that one I got when I was 16. And today I got this one on top. Oh yeah, I wanted to talk a little bit about the aftercare. Pretty much they gave me a solution to clear my ears. It's a clear solution. If you are here because of my ear piercing and you want to learn more about aftercare, the first piercing I got up here, I was stressing with it so much. And the truth is that when you get a piercing on the more meat area of your ear, um, it's best to like forget that you even got it pierced. I mean, when it comes to like hitting it or like walking and accidentally bumping into something, that's when you want to focus or like before you sleep, of course. But during the day, just forget about it because if you touch it and play with it so much, that's when it gets infected. And the reason why it's sticking so awkwardly like that is because it's not pushed back all the way because it's still healing. I literally got it pierced like four or five hours ago. So I've been literally letting it look funky and just leaving it alone pretty much what it looks like i could have got a third one like two pierced they gave me an extra um earring just in case which they were gonna use to give me another piercing but i was like wait just one please <laughs> i'm gonna definitely go back for these because the lady was so nice i'm pretty sure she's not watching this video but she was really really nice wash with the solution morning and night of course um but yeah that's my new ear piercing and i've been so happy literally since i got it like i'm so happy <laughs> so next we're gonna talk about my school graduation which if you guys don't know i am homeschooled uh i've been homeschooled for two years now and it has been great it's just been kind of like weird not being out of school and picking my own schedule it feels like what college should feel like but more classes i guess and before I had six, but now I have seven and I get to choose when I want to do it, but I have a certain amount of work, if that makes sense. I am graduating June 7th, I think. I have to recheck. I mean, we're in February. It's 
five more months you know there's time um and i got my cap and gown in the mail today and i guess i kind of wanted to show that off so um my school colors are orange and yellow so this is what my tassel looks like <laughs> But I really love the colors and the actual the actual cap and gown is just plain black. I'm gonna make obviously a video dedicated to my graduation makeup or my graduation. My forehead looks huge. Yeah. So this is my graduation stuff. The outfit or the gown is black, which makes the yellow and the orange shine really nicely with the outfit. So yeah, I'm super, super excited. I ordered the Jaclyn Hill X Morphe palette volume two. So I bought the first palette. Um, I think, yeah. Okay, the first palette is in my other dresser and I really don't wanna walk over there. So I'm just gonna input pictures on the side. That is what the palette looks like, the first one. Um, I really, really loved it. I used a bunch of the reddish colors kind of for like fall i didn't go towards the more colorful colors but that's my address dang it i did this last video where i accidentally showed off my address but this is let me take it out <laughs> so first there's like this little protector and then is the actual palette so this is what it looks like you see my ring light but it looks like this and then this is the back. If you want to pause and read, you can. Or zoom up and read, you can. But pretty much... Huh, she looks really good in this picture. I love it. But yeah, this is the... The Jaclyn Hill X Murphy Palette Volume 2. It's 1.30 in the morning. I... Okay, I get sleep. I promise. But just like today, I was in... Honestly, this whole day, I've been in such like a happy mood. So I decided like... Why not film a little catch-up chit-chat? But this is what it looks like. It's, I can't explain it. It's more like soft or like it feels laminated and the other palette felt more matte. The other palette, did I say that right? I, I think I did. The other palette felt more matte. This feels more laminated, but this is what it looks like. Um, The back has nothing except for like a little bit of some writing. It says the month, so 12 months from now is when this is probably gonna go bad, so hopefully we use the most of it. Uh, plastic protector. And it says to all my loving subscribers who have supported me all these years, this one's for you, volume two. It says the same thing almost, or has the same design on the other palette, but this is what it looks like. Um, I feel like I'm gonna be using most of these colors, like imagine three lines up and these. I feel like I'll be using most of these, maybe I will, Okay, the reason why I felt like I needed to get this palette is because there are some bright colors in it, but there's also some neutrals, some really nice shimmers, whites. Uh, I feel like she has like almost the same type of thing when it comes to these two. In the other first palette she released, she had almost the same thing with two light shimmers, white shimmers, and then color. Um, but yeah, I feel like this year, um, I want to try to be more outgoing with the makeup styles I do. Um, I want more color. I want more fun. And I feel like I will be able to get it with this palette. I've been addicted to using like fall, autumn colors, reddish colors for so long. And I want to go in with more of these colors right here. More vibrant, more outgoing colors you know honestly looking at all of these colors together the one that i think i'm most excited to use is the shade called positivity like as t this shade right here i think i'm most excited to use that shade um i just wanted to show off the palette today uh i will not be actually playing with it right now because it's one in the morning my skin is so sensitive this okay this is my skin being sensitive. And what I mean by sensitive is if you accidentally go like that, it's gonna leave a mark like that. Like literally, did you guys see that? It just made a mark. My skin is so, so sensitive. Um, since I was younger, like that's that's all I gotta say. I, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, um, later I'll be making a bunch of videos dedicated to this palette and trying it out and making more colorful looks. 
and that's gonna be fun that is pretty much it for this video I it's almost my birthday. My birthday's on the 25th. I have a really fun video planned and I'm gonna try to get this video up by the 23rd. This is the year I turn 18. This is the year I graduate high school. Um, I just, like you guys know when you have a feeling of like, like you know things are gonna be fun. Like I feel like that's what I'm feeling right now, which is ha like, you know <laughs> on my instagram i will be posting about last video which was me unboxing various skincare skincare stuff um that video was really really fun i still haven't posted about it but i think i will tomorrow in the afternoon it's like two in the morning it feels like the after i have to, i need to sleep i need to like turn this off take off my makeup get in my jammies and go to sleep <laughs> Yeah, thank you guys for allowing me to have this little chit chat catch up i have been posting every zero and five so i i posted on the 10th the 15th or i th i think i've been trying to post every five to six days for this month and it has been going really well and for some reason i feel like i've been more energized and happy Every time I post, I want to try to keep this going where every five or six days I upload a video. But if it doesn't work out like that, then it doesn't work out. There's some days when I can't do that because of school. But if you guys are enjoying this overflow of fun, fun content, which has been so exciting for me as well, please let me know and I will do that forgive me for the mess that is right now i just felt really happy and wanted to make a video so here i am i love you guys loads and i hope you enjoyed this video as much as i love to create it um i will see you whenever i see you next bye sometimes i forget that i'm like two feet off the floor <laughs> so <laughs> <laughs> eye that redness a piece of lint got stuck in my eye hour of scratching my eye out and the lint is gone <laughs>